music, I just, I just have to do it. You know, some, some, for some people it's a hobby, but for me it's like a big part of who I am. I guess folk punk, the acoustic, rambling thoughts, I guess. I was in a punk band in the UK in the early 2000s called Fletcher, and uh, we toured a lot, put records out, did all that kind of good stuff. And then uh, when the band broke up, I ended up moving out to Canada. Uh, that's nine years now. Originally from Chatham, and now uh, we live in London. I've been living there for about 15 years. I, I usually try to get back here and play about twice a year. I'm more rooted in folk music. Uh, I, I always say punk country. I, I'm not hard or anything, but it's kind of like outlaw country. So kind of what's going on right now. Culture Factory is all about bringing new experiences to Chatham-Kent, bringing local artists and musicians in touch with traveling artists and musicians, pairing them up, networking opportunities, and bringing new culture to Chatham-Kent as well. It was formerly called CK on the Edge, and in 2012 it morphed into Culture Factory. Um, so now it's a little bit more, uh, moved into a bit of more of a music-based direction. And uh, now we're actually really aligning ourselves with the art community as well. I'm so honored to be a part of Culture Factory's first event of the year. Uh, I'm one of two featured artists. And so tonight I've brought with me just three samples of kind of where my art is headed this year. My main focus when I'm making art is the emotion or the feeling and then a color uh, or, or uh, a gesture that comes from that. Uh, when you see my abstract art, it's usually uh, representational of something I'm probably processing in my head. Uh, but I've also been moving into more representational art with uh, the dog that I did behind me as well. Uh, but again, just that vibrant use of when you see that dog, you know that dog is excited to see you. And so I'm using pinks and yellows instead of a traditional dog color to represent that emotion as well. Through some of my um, professors, uh, they really linked me with some of the communities, and not only in Chatham-Kent, but also in Windsor. So it's really nice to get out there and get active in the art artistic community. I do anything from uh, painting, sculpting. Um, my paintings are mainly abstract, although I don't really limit myself to just that. A lot of my um, course programs require us to do all kinds of figurative stuff. Um, also, as far as sculpture, um, they're kind of like my paintings in a way that they're abstracted from life. Oh, I'm from Chatham. Um, I come back on weekends a lot, actually, uh, just to participate in some of the awesome events that Chatham Kent has to offer. If you go to culturefactory.ca, you'll see that we'll be announcing a series of shows that we're just starting to plan. All musicians, local, paired with an out-of-town act, and paired with a local artist as well. I mean, this crowd right now tells me that we're going to be successful in our mission, so I just want to thank everybody for being here tonight. So, uh, thank you.